guys, Freeze here for another video. Hey guys, um, Freeze here. Hey guys, Freeze here. Hey, what's up guys? Hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, Freeze here for another episode of Super Mario Galaxy X. Ladies and gentlemen, dogs and cats, it is I, 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 Freeze Flame. Welcome back, everybody. Long time no see. Oh, jeez. Man, I don't know what to say. It's like being coming back to a home that's been vacant for six years. Well, I suppose, since it's been a long time, that I should reintroduce myself. Hi. Ah. My name is I, Freeze Flame. How I used to describe myself when I was like a middle schooler was I played a lot of Mario games and a little bit of something else. This was just like a place for me to play games whenever I wanted and to share it with my friends. I didn't really know about it at the time, but this spread to a lot of strangers as well. So it's become a little hobby of mine when I was about like 12, 13 years old. But you know, as time grew on, and I did the whole kind of growing up high school thing, this channel has become more and more of like an embarrassing childhood secret more than anything else. And if I make any new close friends when I was like a junior or senior in high school, just a quick post-recording editor's note, I have no friends. Then the line between having them as a normal friend and a close friend will be them knowing about I freeze flame. <laughs> it's really weird because like for this such a long time, I didn't really want anybody to know that I made videos or like I wanted to be a Let's Player when I was 12 years old and that I raved about having a Nintendo 3DS and I thought it was going to be my last console ever. I'll tell you in a second now why I'm doing this little speech. Because in front of us is a Nintendo 3DS. My first and last console in my whole life. <laughs> Alright, that was pretty fucking cute. Little did you know, hold on for a sec, I got a nice Nintendo Switch! Isn't that awesome? Yeah! <laughs> I would actually look back on these videos, and half of me would cringe because obviously. But on the other hand, it's also like, giving you a really heartwarming feeling. The reason that I came back was, I realized how much fun I wasn't having anymore. I am... 19 year olds now, I'm going through my second year in college, and it's hard to have fun sometimes with a lot of pressure on you. You gotta make money, you gotta progress in life, you gotta have a career path, and really gotta live a lifestyle that, for the most part, lives up to the expectations of other people. And looking back at this channel, like it reminded me of a time where I didn't really give a shit about anything, except what I'd like to do. And my life then was to do my homework, make my parents unlock my laptop for me because they locked it up, otherwise I would play games all day long, and I would not do my homework. It's not like I did it anyway to begin with. <laughs> but, you know, I would like to return to that mentality of doing whatever I like without worrying about things that somebody transitioning into adult life slowly would want to. By the way, I gotta say big shout out to the Jerry SMBX world. What a legend! This man, he's a mad lad! Not only has he been making videos the whole time I was gone, but there's this comment that he said somewhere in one of my videos the last time I, I checked back on my freeze flame. He said that he's been waiting for like 4 or 5 years, and he knows one day I'll be back. Man, this guy has gotta be my favorite viewer. What a legend, SMBX world. Love you, Jerry. So, the big question, what kind of games am I gonna play? Well, I already got that in plan. I'm gonna revisit all of the games that I played when I was a 12 year old. Like, Slender? 
Ooh, I survived! Kimson999 fun fact, I'm the smallest kid in the school. I'm gonna play some Mario games. Speaking of my terrible skills, um, I haven't played SMBX for a long time. Just pretend you didn't die all. Yeah, kill your friends. My apologies, I was not previously aware that any 12-year-old in this country was able to exhibit this level of cruelty. Please do not call PETA, I would greatly appreciate that. There's a lot of things we can do, but I'm gonna revisit who I was as a 12-year-old, first of all, and then we'll get to whatever I want to do. And yeah. Oh, oh, no, 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 no! And I'm s I haven't been excited about anything like this in a while. I think I'm really going to have a lot of fun. I'm literally recording it in my room right now. I didn't really prepare for this. I have no script. I'm probably going to edit this really lightly. I'm not really expecting to you know, become popular or like make money. But I think as long as I enjoy myself, then you know, there is a reason to justify this channel continuing to exist. So hope you guys enjoy. I'm going to make more videos soon. Well, actually, I'm gonna make it whenever I feel like it, but yeah, this is what it feels like to come back to a YouTube channel that you vacated for six years. I don't think many people on this platform have done that. <laughs> um, I'm your neighborhood-friendly squeaker from six years ago. I, Freeze Flame, and hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>